What's up, everybody? It is time for NT. The wait is over. How many logo mans are we going to pull today? We're going to get started on case one. Sold out. We got three sold out uh, case breaks to start the morning for NT basketball, guys. But we do have uh, more throughout the day, so get your jump on NT before it's too late. I'm going to go live on Facebook, and then we'll get case one started. Hope everybody's having a good Friday. Happy Friday. Without further ado, let's get into case one. What's going down, everybody? It's time for 2018-19 National Treasures Basketball, four box case number one. Let's see if this lives up to the hype. We've got cases all day today. PYT, random, tiered, random number, regular random. Lots of stuff going down today for NT Day. Happy NT Day. Happy Friday. We got Aikens Matt with the Pelicans, Alex with the Bulls, Angelo with the Sixers, A.T. Kelly Grizzlies Wizards, Bane Squire with the Nets, Benjamin Hornets, Big Apple Heat, Camelin with the Raptors, Derek with the Magic, DM Collector with the Celtics, Dustin with the Spurs, Eric with the Kings and Bucks, Heavy Hitters with the Jazz, Jay Horton with the Pacers, JT Hawks Suns, JVD Thunder, Kaquan Blazers, Kasai Clippers, KSP Pistons, Macho Rockets, Matsumura with the Mavericks, uh, Mitch G with the Nuggets, uh, Neil with the Timberwolves, Nick Dan with the Warriors, Scott with the Knicks, Spurs fan Lakers, and Viss with the Cavaliers. What's up, Ted? All right. Case four has Bulls and Nuggets left. All right. Got a Michael Porter or Wendell Carter there. To chase. Lots of local mans in this product. The one on one Mahomes. Okay, sure. Did you send it through the website or did you send it to Mojo Break at Gmail? All right. Dan's going to rock it. Case two coming up next. Great moment in this hobby. Great time with the uh, NFL draft. This product coming out. Baseball. Vlad Guerrero coming up today. Craziness. Okay, I'll check into it right after I do this case for you, Tyler. Printing plates on the bottom, like they do always. Jimmy Butler, Timberwolves, one on one plates. Jimmy B, going out to Minnesota, and Neil. That is out of uh, 1718 National Treasures Game Gear printing plates. Four of 39, Steven Adams for the Thunder. All NBA materials, Jimmy Butler this time on the Sixers. Going out to Philadelphia and Angelo. The logo man. And same design. This one's going to be the prime version. Oh, what do we got going on here? Three of 25 for the Pacers. Prime. Victor Oladipo. Nice looking card there. Nice prime. Wonder how the Pacers would have done with Depot in the playoffs. Jay Horton. And if you like that card, you'll like this one too. Victor Oladipo, 85-99. Pacers, Jay Horton. <laughs> J. 
We got a Lonnie Walker, 45 of 99. Jerseys going out to the Spurs. And Dustin. All right, and our first auto. 10 of 49 sticker auto jersey. J.R. Smith, Game Gear. The MVP of last year's finals. That was question was about putting the Mahomes up for by an hour best. Time. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, we don't do... Uh, Tyler, we just saw the email. We don't do buy it nows on those. We only consign it at. It's, uh, just, it's just too time consuming it's to too, build offers. Exactly. And coordinate with the seller with every offer that comes in. Ten, ten of ninety nine colossal for the Celtics. Al Horford. DM collector. I'll use the horn as fit. <laughs> One of 25 treasures of the hall on card, Magic Johnson, former GM of the Lakers. Let's see where he goes. Spurs fan. Max was going down. And Game Gear Prime, 10 of 25 going out to the Heat, Mr. Chris Bosch. Chris Bosch for the Heat. Going out to Big Apple. Is there another card underneath that? No. no. Another card in the box? Nope. 10 of 25, Chris Bosch. Sorry, yes. All right, let's get an RPA. I think RPAs are averaging about two per case. No RPA in that first box. Redemption on the bottom. Redemption. For the Hawks, John Collins. Horizontal patch auto out of Flawless. Last year's Flawless 17-18 rookie plates. Going out to Atlanta. ATL. JT. Ten of ten, John Collins. That is correct, Eric. Yep, you have the Kings and Bucks. Ten of ten, John Collins. For the Spurs, DeMar DeRozan, 37-99, going out to the Spurs. Second hit for Dustin. And very nice. Let's pull off that victory tonight, guys. 15-25, prime Steph Curry. 15-25. We don't want to go to no game seven. Nick Dan, Warriors. Fifty nine to ninety nine. John Wall game gear going out to the Wizards. Value team with the Wizards. At Kelly. Yeah, I heard the Rockets are already in the Bay Area. <laughs> Gary Harris forty to ninety nine going out to the Nuggets. Denver and Mitch. Got a Sarunas Marshallonis on card auto 56 and 99 international treasures going out to the dubs. Two dubs in this box. Warriors. And for the Nuggets, Peerless Signatures 26 and 99 Antonio McDice. Denver as well. Mitch. Got a 44 of 99 swipe of the Fox, De'Aaron Fox, Colossal Jersey Auto. Very nice. Going out to the Kings. I'm going to probably need uh, some, some uh, checklist work on this next one. What's up, Jameson? Nice uh, De'Aaron for Eric. I'm stalling for the checklist. PYT1, yep, PYT2 coming up next. Treasures of the Hall, Redemption, Charles Barkley. Treasures of the Hall. Yep, card number 14. Just as treasures of the hall. Okay. Card number. 
14. 76ers. Sixers. Going out to the 76ers. Congrats, Charles Barkley. He was live in a lot of products. I guess not anymore. Angelo. All right, so we should have an RPA, I'm thinking. A little R-Pizzle. NT all day, guys. You can check our schedule at mojobreak.com. Those are times are Pacific. If you're on PC, the schedule's on the right side of the site. Mobile, it's all the way at the bottom. And those are the times of our next breaks. We've got uh, six more PYTs today that have spots available. We also have random team, random number, tiered. Lots of stuff today. Card on the bottom's got a little bit of blue on it. We'll see. Jordan Clarkson, Logo Man Autographs Plate, going out to the Lakers. And Spurs fan. 57 of 99, Kawhi Leonard. Got a little bit of um, chipping down there at the edge at the edges there. Who you guys uh, who do you guys got? Toronto or Philadelphia? Game one. Game one tomorrow. Toronto, Philadelphia. Raptors and uh, Carnelian. 83 of 99. Carl Malone, the mailman. Jazz. Heavy hitters. Century materials. They need to get some ink of this guy. They need to sign Mr. KG, Kevin Garnett. They need to get his autos and products. 84 of 99. And Tim Duncan. Those are the two guys. 71 of 99, Rodney all good in the hood going out to the Cavs, Cavaliers, and Viss. Yeah, happy Vlad Day for sure. Got your Raptors? See, I'm going Philly. I'm going Philly in five. Yeah, I'm going crazy. 31 of 99, Alfred Payton for the Pelicans and Aikens, Matt. 24. Of 25, Jared Terrell for the Timberwolves. Undrafted rookie Jared Farrell. Who knows? Maybe. Neil, oh, Timberwolves, well represented in NT. 12 of 99, D. Brown. Celtics. And clutch factor, I want to talk to Samson. Ralph Sampson. Going out to the Kings. And we got an RPA. Going out to the Kings. And for the Knicks, 7 to 25, Alonzo Trier. Not the true RPA, but uh, these hold their value pretty well. 7 to 25, Trier for the Knicks. Oh, you met D. Brown? Nice hit for the Knicks and Scott. Trier's got a little bit of hype. We'll see. Maybe a better rookie than Knox at the end of the... Yeah, it's like he changed his auto. He shorthanded it a little bit. Yep, horizontal RPA. But unlike the other sports, the horizontal RPAs in basketball do pretty close. They do pretty well compared to the verticals. Oh, yeah, we got uh, plenty of Flawless, Josh. Um, we're going to have our schedule loaded with Flawless over the weekend. It's another blue card on the bottom. <laughs> we'll see. A lot of blue teams, though. Bucks, Sydney Moncrief 101 Premium Ink Flawless Plate. Got a Miles Bridges. Ooh, this might be pretty valuable. 10 of 99. Miles Bridges does not have any autos because he's an upper deck exclusive. So this would be similar to the Ben Simmons NTs. So that could be a huge card. Never know. Charlotte, 10 of 99. Obviously, he's not as hyped up as Simmons, but Benjamin with the Hornets. And 
and 48 and 99 Luca jersey. Don Shik triple jersey. Look at the I don't think I've seen them play in those Mavericks unis. Those are pretty tight. Obviously the jerseys are not from that jersey, but 48 and 99 going out to the Mavericks. Matsumera. Definitely, definitely. I've been I've been living this thing for eight years. <laughs> Hoping that uh, Upper Deck doesn't sign um, Mr. Zion. And seven of twenty-five, DeAndre Jordan, Material Treasures Prime, back to back on uh, the Mavericks. Sixty-three and ninety-nine more Hornets. Glenn Rice, one of the nicest NBA players I've ever met. Super cool, dude. 63 and 99. What happened to Glenn Rice Jr., by the way? I haven't heard much about him. Is he D-leaguer? Benjamin. For the Pistons. Andre Drummond, 43 and 99. Detroit. And KSP. He went to jail? Dang. Well. The D-league. The D-league. The J-league. <laughs> Got a 23 and 99 John Collins treasured signatures. Watch out for this guy next year. I like John Collins. Watch out for that game. Yeah, watch out for depending on who they get, right? Or if they get Zion, that'd be crazy. 23 and 99. Hawks, JT. I mean, I Got a 17 and 99 North Carolina Jerry Stackhouse. He's a Stackhouse. Mavericks. California Penal League. <laughs> And uh, 67 of 99, Zach Levine. Going out to the Bulls. And Alex. RPA for the Mavericks. Costas. Ante Tacumpo. 40 of 49. Based on name alone, should just go up in value, right? No, no vertical, huh? 40 of 49. Mavericks. <laughs> that was a total Mavs box. It was building up. I was about to ready to lose it and run around, but cost us. You never know. You never know. Does he have the wingspan? He's six foot eleven. Got a little bit of white on the bottom on the back there, but that is common with these cards. All right, that was case one, guys. The brother of the MVP 101. And you know, that's another guy. Trier and Costas did not have a lot of autos. We'll see. I, I don't know. I don't know if that was a terrible case or a good case. I might have to, that might be one of those cases that we look back in a couple of years and be like, man, that was a really good case. Oh, I didn't, uh, didn't record. Uh, yes. There is hit list credits. Yeah, they're going to be... They're probably... After the third case, they'll all be probably processed. Yeah. Just making sure I recorded it right. All right. Case two coming up next, guys. Dan's going to rock that one. I think he may beat my case if I'm putting my money on it. Let's see. All right. Well. 
see if the uh, vertical RPAs do exist. How's everybody doing? Little release day, National Treasures. What is going on, everybody? This is our 2018-19 National Treasures Basketball PYT number two, done on release day 426. We have at Kelly with the Cavaliers and Wizards, uh, Bane, Band Squire, Band Squire with the Nets, Caesars with the Bulls, Chris K with the Bucks, DM Collector with the Hawks, Dustin with the Spurs, E James with the Hornets. Garrick with the Celtics, uh, Godwitz with the Grizzlies, Golfo with the Raptors, Hardy Wang with the Pelicans, Hair MT with the Warriors, Heavy Hitters with the Jazz, Jay Horton with the Pacers, JT with the Suns, K Kwan with the Blazers, Kasai with the Clippers, uh, Macho with the Rockets, Maple with the Heat, uh, Matsumura with the Mavericks, Matthew F. with the Pistons, Neil O. with the Timberwolves, Pietti with the Magic, Wren with the Sixers, Scott with the Knicks, Spurs fan with the Lakers, Stone with the Thunder, Viss with the Kings, and Will Master with the Nuggets. All right, good luck, everybody. I'm calling my shot. I'm calling a Trey RPA, Trey Young. Calling it. Calling it, calling it. Uh, not one case down. Uh, had a probably the biggest hit was the Barkley Charles Barkley redemption. RPAs may have been a little lackluster. Those will still sell pretty well, though. All the RPAs are gonna sell well. What's up, Ted? All right. Box one going down. I'm calling Trey Young. Logo man. Logo Dan. Yep, Carter Keyboom called up. Oh, he did? Yep. Wow. That's quick. Hey, just a rookie? Like, or just, just drafted? I don't know which Keyboom. There's, there's two of them, right? Pull the printing plate up to the top. Is that Steven Jackson? Steven Jackson going out to the Pacers. One of one printing plate. You count these as hits? Yeah. Going out to the Pacers and Jay Horton. Base card 67 to 99. Kyrie Irving. Celtics. First hit, old school relic, 41 and 99. Dominique Wilkins going out to the Atlanta Hawks. And the Hawks on the board. It's not Trey Young yet, but. Building up. Building up. DM Collector with the Atlanta Hawks. 16 of 25, Prime Patch Terrence Ross. Going out to the Magic. He used to be a Raptor, right? Yep. Terrence Ross, 18 of 25. Going out to the Magic. Pietti. A Lillard Immaculate RPA. Nice, 650, that's not bad. 
It, maybe. It sounds like it. 81 and 99. Nikola Jokic. Going out to the Nuggets. Oh, and Will Master. Is that going to game seven? Yeah. Well, who did? Colossal who did Relic, Miller, 25 and 99. Wendell Carter Jr. Rookie Relic. Yeah, for Going out to the Bulls. Game seven, was that tomorrow? And Caesars Palace with the Bulls. 12 of 99. Auto Relic Gary Harris. Going out to the Nuggets. Twelve and ninety-nine, Gary Harris. Game Gear Auto Relic, sixty-six and ninety-nine, Pascal Siakam. Yeah, I was trying to buy one for that too, Eric. Getting the Raptors on the board. Golfo. On card auto hometown heroes, Larry Bird, Larry the Legend. Going out to the Celtics. Actually surprised this wasn't on the bottom. Yeah, compared to that one. Yeah. Maybe the only auto you're gonna see with uh, with him in this uni ever. Thirty-eight and ninety-nine. Demarcus Cousins, little boogie cousins auto for the Warriors. Dubs. And hair with the Warriors. Well, we did a pretty good job of spreading out the love there. No, Doug didn't get it. Was it a was it an auction or a buy it now or best offer? It was the best offer. Offer wasn't the best, huh? I thought I offered six fifty, but I guess not. <laughs> All right, box two. Now, speaking of that dude, on the bottom. One on one printing plate, Damian Lillard. Out of 17, 18 National Treasures. Going out to the Blazers. K. Kwan. Sixty-eight of ninety-nine, Anthony Davis, Pelicans. Fifty-eight of ninety-nine, Damian Lillard, Relic. Going out to the Blazers, K. Kwan. Maybe we game used. Game worn. All right, all right, all right. There you go, Panini. Six of ten retro material, Shaquille O'Neal on the Suns. Think of Shaq, you obviously think of the Suns. Or the Cavaliers. Or the Celtics. <laughs> yeah, not the Suns. Well, they got a jersey, dude. I was just naming off all the teams that you wouldn't think of, but he did, he, he did play for. Going out to JT. 96 of 99, Josh Okaji Relic. Going out to the Timberwolves. The Timberwolves are going to be one of those teams that are under, under 100 bucks and hit pretty consistently. Yeah. Neil Lowe. They actually have a decent amount of logo mans too. I was looking at the checklist. 65 of 99, Jalen Brunson. Rookie Relic. Going out to the Mavericks. Shaktis. Matsumura. 57 of 99. Hometown Heroes Auto. Bill Cartwright. Old school. Going out to the Bulls and Caesars Palace.
Another old school auto, 22 of 25, Derek Harper. Going out to the Mavericks. They forget to put rookie autos in this product. What's going on? And Matsumura, peerless signatures. 11 of 25, Artis Gilmore. Colonels goes to whatever team he played the most NBA games with, and I want to say it's the Bulls. The artist known as Gilmore? And the big leprechaun. Sack down. Chicago seven seasons. Bulls on the artist Gilmore. Spurs, I know, I know he played for the Spurs, but played for the Celtics too. Nineteen of twenty-five game gear auto relic, the Greek freak Giannis Antetokounmpo. Nice. A little bam, going out to the Milwaukee Bucks and Chris. Another team under a hundred bucks could be a could be a sleeper team there. Well, I think your first two boxes didn't have a rookie in it either. I had Trier in my first and my second box. Okay. But I did have one that had Bosch and one that had Barkley. So. Or maybe it was my first two. I think it was, yeah, because I think my last two. your last two had rookies. All right. Well, let's see an RPA here. R Pizzle. We got a redemption in there. Nope. Got a Trevor Ariza going out to the Rockets. Macho with the Rockets. Bottom two have RPAs. 94 of 99. Wiggins base card. Andrew Wiggins. My dude, Santa Clara University. 33 of 82. Steve Nash. Going out to the Suns. Sun. Local man's are falling about one every 10 cases. Local man autos are one. All three. NBA materials relic 44 of 99. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Milwaukee Bucks. Colossal 67 of 99. Costas Antetokounmpo. Get the other one too. It appears. Going out to the Mavericks. 77 of 99. Juan Hernan Gomez. Nuggets. Is he playing? Who? Juan. Yeah, I, so. I got to check on this one. Card number? 42. Colossal material autographs. Tim Hardaway Jr. Knicks. Going out to the New York Knicks. Confirmed on Panini's checklist. Scott with the Knicks. Tim Hardaway Jr. Auto Relic. 50 of 99 Peerless Signatures. Old School Auto. Bernard King. Going out to the New York Knicks. Check out those unis and check out my short shorts. Mark. <laughs> Got a 22 of 49 penmanship, Mark Eaton. I'm going to hit you up over here, is that okay? Guy looks like a ball player. <laughs> Eaton? Eaton. Heavy hitters, Utah Jazz. There you go, on the board. Yeah, this number two. And true RPA, 55 of 99, 
Vertical Shy Gilgis Alexander. Little bam. Going out to the Clippers and Kasai. Congrats. Definitely in the top 10 rookies you want to get. Maybe top five. Are we making a comeback? What size is that, man? It's a 130. There you go, Kasai. Congrats. Uh, this was a PYT, so uh, all the teams were individually priced. And it looks like they started at. 49 bucks. Went up to uh, around 1,000 for the Mavericks. But there's, uh, you have to go to our site to find out. Uh, there's randoms, there's random numbers. There's, uh, we're doing about 20 different breaks of NT. Yeah, there's tons of different styles of breaks. Always has. Well, they know that's the most collectible. Yeah, player. that's the one that everybody wants to collect is the number to 99. RPA was Shy Gilgis Alexander. Bill Walton? Bill Walton going out to the Blazers. 101 printing plate. And that is out of... 17, 18, flawless. 75 and 99, Kevin Durant, little KD. Pretty good game. Last game just wasn't enough. Got to do better. 35 of 99, Luka Doncic, triple relic. Rookie relic. Mavericks. What's up, Carlos? <laughs> What's up, Rich? This is this free break? <laughs> How you doing, man? 20 of 25, Dion Waiters. Going out to the Miami Heat. And Maple, getting heat on the board. What's up, Carlos? Thirty-five of ninety-nine. Big game, James Worthy. I think that gets the Lakers on the board finally. Lakers, Spurs fan. Got to be game used, right? Game worn. Seven of 99, little Hamadou. Hamadou Diallo. Rookie relic going out to the OKC Thunder. Stone. With the thunder. I'm pretty sure, but you know, things can get wacky. Redemption Signatures Gold Card 17. Chris Mullen. It is Warriors. Going out to the Warriors. I know that's number two. Card number 17, which is his number. Number to 10. Number to 10. Number to 10. Golden State. Old school, Chris Mullen. 34 of 49 NBA greats, Joe Dumars. Pistons. Matthew F. with the Pistons. And the Pistons on the board. And again, did a pretty good job of spreading out the love here. 72 of 99, International Treasures, Kristaps Porzingis. Going out to the New York Knicks. And last hit of the break. Horizontal RPA, 20 of 25. Kyrie Thomas. Going out to the Pistons. Good value spot there at the Pistons. 20 at 25. What time do we have? Uh, 
I think so. Did I did I just go too fast? No, I, I think we might have started it just a little early. We started early? I think we might No. Have. No, that's not how we roll. <laughs> More NT today, guys. The next break is sold out. All right. We'll issue the Hitless credits. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out. That was our PYT number two. We did hit a vertical RPA that time of Shy Gilgis Alexander. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out. Let me save the video and upload it. And PYT number three coming up next. I'll do that in like 19 minutes. I thought I went really slow. All right. We get the other case on the table. We got a little bit of time. So yeah, we've got uh, random groups today, random numbers. We're about 15 minutes ahead of time on this one, so we're gonna hang out for a little while. Um, just so make, people can make, make sure they come in and they see their break, you know what I mean? So uh, we're gonna have more Flawless throughout the weekend, more Bowman, uh, maybe some Leaf Metal. So the schedule was uh, currently being worked on for the weekend, so we're gonna be live all weekend as well. More NT as well on the weekend, and uh, C-Rad's cooking up C Rad is cooking up a monster NBA uh, mixer with NT first off the line in it. So uh, it's going to be ridiculous. So we have 14, 15 flawless in that mixer as well. Some Supreme Hard Court, some regular NT, some Select, some Prism, probably some Prism Choice. Um, so check out that mixer. He's going to be going down. I think he's going to do it for Sunday, I'm thinking. So. Uh, see, because see, Rad's working into the night, and, he, and he's getting his schedule ready for the weekend right now. I did number one already, Dan. Huh? Yeah. So, what do you guys think about the uh, NFL draft yesterday? Any uh, surprises? Jeff, I was gonna say, dude, oh, you you read my mind. We said that basically at the same time, even though you're on a delay. Um, are you, uh, are you disappointed that you guys didn't get a tight end? I was thinking of you. I love my pick. I just don't like the controversy surrounding him. So hopefully that, uh, goes away real quick as soon as he plays. Yep. Yeah, two large markets. And then don't sleep on N. Keel Harry for the Patriots, dude. I I mean, Patriots don't tend to draft receivers that early. And that dude can put up some highlight reel catches, man. So, you know, Brady connecting with him. N. Keel Harry might be crazy. Ah, uh, Vlad Jr. showed up today wearing his dad's jersey. That's pretty awesome. Oh, nice. Daniel Jones, the new Blake Bortles. That should surprise everybody. There was, uh, so I was listening to Shine on Sports this morning and some guy called in. Uh, said he was at uh, he was meeting his his buddy at at a bar to watch the draft and his buddy was a Giants fan and uh, the guy was stuck in traffic and he got there and they're like dude you guys got your QB and he's like sweet Dwayne Haskins he's all nope oh dude this draft looks incredible for the hobby what are you talking about it, it it's uh, it, it's like the in the last seven or eight years it's the most uh, QBs, and you've got uh, Josh Jacobs. I wouldn't say it's the best. Yeah, but three, uh, three. It could just be. It could just be three quarterbacks. That'd be fine. For three first round quarterbacks, and the number one guy going to a Cardinals. Nobody cares about anybody but quarterbacks. So, so if you had ten wide receivers and ten running backs, it'd be better than a three quarterback draft. Dude, 
Yeah, QBs are the only one to collect. It, it could be 30 guys that are Q, uh, running backs and, and, and wide receivers and no quarterbacks taken. It would be a horrible draft. I like Josh Allen. Not last year's Josh Allen. This year's Josh Allen. He has 17 sacks after the entire fourth fumble. He barely played over half the snaps. Yeah, they were saying that he basically he drops back in coverage. Like, that... Yeah, next, well, and then you also, what you guys got to figure too, so think about it this way, for the hobby, right? Think about it this way, they're going to make cards, they're, they're going to make cards, and then they got, they got uh, the, the, all the second year guys that are going to be in the product, they got Mahomes that's going to be in the product, so you're going to have Baker Mayfield, Saquon Autos, um, and the Lamar Jackson, all the guys that were drafted last year, plus the three rookies this year, so between two years of rookie classes, you've got eight rookie quarterbacks so i mean not rookies in their second year but i would have definitely gone bosa over him but i think i would have gone allen over yeah i mean that that pick may bite them in the butt especially if uh murray sucks but it's a simple fact that the guy doesn't want to uh Yeah, the hobby's about the rookie cards, and there's three huge rookies in the first round. But I'm saying the second that there could be one quarterback drafted, and the hype from 17 and 18 is going to sell this year, no matter what. Da I know I don't like Dak. Yeah, I mean everybody likes that kid Jones, and look what Saquon did for running backs last year. Now I, I don't think Raiders will sell like the Giants players do, but. With a running back, and you're t yeah, Jones, Murray, and Haskins. They're gonna they're gonna buy him. People were buying Kyle Laletta at the beginning of the year just cause. Yeah, I'll give you that. Sa Saquon is a superstar. Yeah, yeah. You can't really compare any running back this year to that guy, obviously. All right, I got about nine minutes until we get into case three. <laughs> We're ahead of schedule. Yeah, I wouldn't necessarily say, Jeff, that buying this rookie class is great. But the hype leading into this rookie class with Kyler going first, with Hassan's going to the Redskins, with Jones going to the Giants, um, it's, 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 it's enough. One of those guys would have been enough to carry the hype again. The hype right now is so big, it doesn't matter. That That's the point of view I'm making. Now, I'm not saying it's the most skilled draft. I'm not saying... Daniel Jones is going to be the next superstar. I'm not even saying Kyler Murray. I, I don't believe in Kyler Murray, but his hype is enough to sell cards. Yeah, Jones. What? Yeah, exactly. Jones was in the conversation to be. Now Locke was ahead of Jones, but I think it's um, somebody gave Daniel Jones a terrible ranking, and I think it affected his draft value on mock, on mock boards. But I don't think Arizona – see, here's the thing, Jeff. I don't think Arizona fans buy their cards. Fans of the players buy his cards. That's where it's different. Fans of the players buy his cards. It, like, people that buy Luka, people that buy Luka Doncic, they're not Maverick fans. They're not Maverick fans.
Look how many people were Bo Jackson fans. Was Kansas, was the Kansas City Royals a huge market? It does hurt. No, I'm not, I'm not saying it did, but I don't think it's going to prevent people from collecting them. Yeah. yeah, basketball, you have the entire world, for sure. But I think this hobby is starting to open up. That's why Baker Mayfield's pricing is way higher than any of us would have predicted. Nobody would ever have predicted contenders of... Uh, Baker Mayfield, a base contenders. Baker Mayfield's going for fifteen, sixteen hundred. Nobody would have predicted that at the beginning of last year. So just all the people that are coming into collecting and latching on to guys. Yeah, it's exactly. It's what it is. Is hype. Murray safe for one year, guaranteed. The ultimate hype train. <laughs> oh, you mean it sounds like the hype as far as the show. Uh, Jay, we already did PYT 1 and 2. This is going to be PYT Case 3 coming up in uh, five minutes. Hey, hey, what's up, Carlos? Yeah, see, Carlos on Facebook, he collects players over teams. Me too. I have Ben Simmons. I, do I like the Sixers? Quietly, I like the Sixers, but I'm a Warrior fan. Yeah, I followed, I followed that after a little while, Aaron. <laughs> I, but I think I said hype about, like, what, 15 times in the last five minutes, so. <laughs> Dude, what's up with Oscar? Why do, you, why do you miss so much of, of the end of the year? Was he hurt, or was he just bench? I don't know. I know he got hurt in the playoffs. He got hurt in the playoffs, and he missed, he missed game seven. Yeah. Yeah, Green Bay's a team of history, absolutely. Like, when he came, because uh, he got activated. Didn't he get benched, or like, I think, dude, I think he got, I think he was a healthy scratch for a while. Look at the hype about uh, Zion next year. Look at the hype of next year's draft. It's crazy. And when that kind of attention is pay, uh, put on other sports in this industry, people start crossing over, trying to. Oh, I can't buy. I can't buy Zion, so maybe I can buy Murray, or maybe I can buy Vlad. I'm looking for the investment. What what guy can I buy, or what guy can I chase in a break, or what you know. So that's, uh, I think it, you start as a lot of collectors, you'll probably hear stories of them starting as baseball card collectors. Then they cross over to basketball because they start seeing sales on basketball cards and cross over to other sports too. So, I hope not, Aaron. <laughs> But uh, I, I wouldn't put my money betting against that. You know, Brian, honestly, I hope it stops. I hope it gets back to, you know, I mean, it's just too crazy right now. Maybe not stops, but slows down. <laughs> I mean, and unfortunately for us, I mean, so the distributors have a product that's at a, a, a stupid, ridiculous pre-sale price that they know is not what it's worth. So they don't want to give it to anybody anymore. So they're not, if they, if they gave it to us at pre-sale, then they lose $3,000 based on the open market or $4,000. So what happens is every more, another hot release, we get allocated, regardless of our spend. We get less and less and less, and they hold more back. And um... <laughs> send me your sales figures. See, I think you'd be okay with that, but I don't know how the rest of the uh, hobby would, uh, be, would, would, would view that <laughs> without an explanation. Pretty much, Aaron. Yeah, we had uh, a lot of status. Still do. Exactly, Nelly. It's crazy.
But, you know, if these Lucas and all these RPAs live up to the predicted price, it's not going down. That's the thing. These RPAs just going to get higher every year. These RPAs continue to go up. So if there's 99 $10,000 Luca cards in this, not even counting logo mans or anything lower than that, if there's 99 base RPAs that are $10,000 cards, the product's not going down. All right, we got one minute, one minute. All right, let me move this last case and get started. Get a logo, man. What's going down, everybody? It's time for 2018-19 National Treasures NBA four-box case number three. Pick your team style. Going down on release, the 26 guys. We've got Allen with the Lakers, Alex with the Bucks and Warriors, Amihan with the Rockets, Andrew with the Timberwolves, Arms JM Pistons, um, A.T. Kelly with the Wizards, Bama with the Jazz, Bain Squire with the Nets, Benjamin with the Pelicans, Big Apple with the Celtics, D2 Deep with the Hawks, Dew with the Bulls, DM Collector with the Mavericks, Dustin Ray with the Spurs, Eric with the Clippers, uh, God Wits with the Grizzlies, Golfo with the Raptors, Hardy with the Heat, Jay Sink with the Cavaliers, Jennings Steve with the Hornets, Jay Horton with the Pacers, Jay Rome with the Sixers, JT with the Suns, Mitch with the Nuggets, Rich Sport Cards with the Magic, Scotts with the Blazers, uh, Stone with the Thunder, Takanasu with the Kings, and Vis with the Knicks. Guys, good luck. NT Case 3. We also got uh, random team style today. Uh, I think the first one's getting close to being filled. We got Tiered. Tiered's a fun one because you're guaranteed a top 15 team. Two teams per spot. Yeah. Yeah. Car Sorry, Carlos. I just saw your... Facebook doesn't scroll for some reason. But, uh, yeah, I'm a huge Bo fan, too. What is MSFT? What is that? All right. On this third case, uh, me and Dan are splitting it. So, hopefully, my half is better. Hopefully, I get the logo, man. Redemption on the bottom. Same amount as GTS on pre sale. Zach Collins for the Blazers going out to Scott. What's up, Scott? Thanks for joining, man. This is case three, Star I am. Case number three. Chris Stapps, one of 39. 39. Going out to the Knicks. Ah, Microsoft, see? Didn't know that. Eight of 99. Chris Paul for the Rockets, Jersey. Ami Hunt. And one of 10, prime John Stockton, all treasured all decade, 1990s. John Stockton for the Jazz. And Bama. 12 of 99, Dante DiVincenzo for the Milwaukee Bucks and Alex. Uh, they might be all gone, but the Timberwolves, a good team to have. 
42 of 99. They have uh, probably the most na- uh, logo mans out of some of the bottom tier teams. Mark, and I wouldn't even call him bottom tier, probably mid tier. 42 of 99, Mark Aguirre for the Mavericks. But I just told that to the entire chat, so <laughs> I don't I don't know. You have to get on it now. They may be gone though. Mavericks and DM collector. Oh. On Green Bay. Yeah, it's hard to keep up, man. Seventy five and ninety nine peerless signatures, big country Bryant Reeves for the Grizzlies. Back when they were in Canada, going out to Memphis and God, God wits. I think Green Bay is going to be good, dude. I think uh, I think Aaron Rodgers is going to go pretty far this year. Seems like it's it seems like he's due. And seventy four and ninety nine Zildrunas Ilogowskis International Treasures, going out to the Cavaliers. And J Sync. <laughs> and Nikola Jokic, twelve of twenty five going out to the Nuggets. Twenty five sticks. Nuggets. This guy's stuff kind of goes up and down. Probably up after how he's been playing. Or no, did Jokic? It was Jokic the one got hurt. Nurkic. Nurkic. Yeah, Jokic is playing. That's the one you were talking about. That's what I thought. And very nice. Colossal material autographs. Prime Giannis. So that'll be on card, and it'll be prime. So that'll be a big card. Bucks. Milwaukee, and who's got them Bucks? That is Alex. Very nice. National treasures. National treasures all day, guys. NT all day. All right, let me get a let me get a RPA here at least. Uh, Pistons one on one. Grant Hill. Arms JM. One of thirty nine. Joel Embiid for the Sixers and J Rome. 41 of 49, Mitch Richmond. I didn't know they had jerseys that color, but. Going out to the Warriors and Alex. And here's a nice one. Colossal Rookie Prime for the Nuggets. Michael Porter Jr. 9 of 25. Looks like a Blazers jersey. Yeah, maybe not quite. Player worn material going out to the Nuggets, nine of twenty five, Denver. Mitch. Rookie Jersey. Lonnie Walker for the Spurs. Dustin. And uh, second time it's happened to me today. Back to back. Different design this time, though. Lonnie Walker. Jersey. Back to back Spurs. And Colossal. Auto Jersey. Mark Elfoltz. Three of 99 going out to the Sixers. First overall pick, J. Rome. Now on Orlando. 
And one of the more underrated guys in the league here. Four of five emerald for the Grizzlies, Mike Conley, Memphis. God wits. And lasting legacies 15 to 25, Jersey Auto, Magic Johnson. Magic Lakers, Allen. And ending it off with a guy that can never sign on the sticker all decades, 1990s. The Admiral, 8 of 10. I don't know why they ever have him sign stickers because he just, he's like, you know, I don't even care. My autograph is too big. I'm not even going to try to get it on the sticker. I'm not even going to try. This is case number three, PYT. Spurs and Dustin. All right, so no rookie patch autos for me yet. And I even went one stack, so... No, because there was one of one and two of two. So should I text him? I already sent him an email. Because I actually double checked the invoice and it had 40. Oh, okay. We got 24. All right, good luck. Looking for the RPAs. Looking to try to cut a box. There we go. There's always stickers in National Treasures. Always. Actually, there is more on-card autos that I've seen in here than in previous years. Yeah. They have a lot of subsets that are on-card. Got a one-of-one one Pau Gasol. Yeah, it should, going out to the Spurs. David Robinson should just be an on-card guy only. If you can't do it, I don't think we, I don't think we have to have David Robinson autos, right? I mean, at the point, I know he's a Hall of Famer, but or you can just deal with the signature. What do you mean? <laughs> just deal with it. He inscribed, put fifty on there. Looks good. <laughs> Five of ten. Ennis Cantor. New York Knicks. Hey, what's going on? Good, how are you? Good. 42 of 99, Michael Porter Jr. Going out to the Nuggets. Mitch, the Nuggets. Got a prime colossal 24 of 25, Dion Waiters. Deion Waiters going out to the Heat. Hardy Wang with the Heat. Is that game used? Game worn. All right. 71 of 99 going out to the Hornets. Glenn Rice. Going out to Jennings and the Hornets. Timeline Relic, Andre Drummond, 81 of 99. Going out to the Pistons. Pistons have hit, I think, in every case so far. Good value spot. Arms Jam. I'm with you on that. 
93 of 99, J.J. Redick. Going out to the 76ers. And J. Rome. On card auto. J.J. Redick. And another on card auto. 58 of 99, hometown heroes, Joe Dumars. Just talking about the Pistons. All up in it. Sure, Shep. Send me an email. I'll point in the right direction. There's really, there's really not much. So, business license and a resale license from uh, the BOE. And that is pretty much all you need. Now, I can also point you in the direction of which, since you're in California and you're local, I can point you in the uh, couple distributors. It's going to be tough to be able to get pre-orders, pre but you'd definitely be able to get um, supplies and shelf stock. But pre-orders are going to be tough. 44 of 49, Troy Brown, RPA, going out to the Wizards. And A. Kelly. The Wizards. But yeah, send me an email. I'll uh, I'll point you in the right direction. Really, again, there's really not much, not much you got to do. Then a couple uh, when you find distributors, a couple dealer applications, and they're gonna ask for your resale license and uh, copy your business license, and that's pretty much that's pretty much it. You have a seller's permit? Well, yeah, just the uh, just the California business license, which I think is two hundred and ninety bucks. I think a year. Going out to the Magic One Hundred One Printing Plate, Nikola Vucevic, Orlando, and Rich. Twenty six of ninety nine, Jeremy Lamb. They just got Cameron Mavens. I think they don't have yeah, to pick them up. You haven't really had the rest of the, the judges out for a while too. Jeremy Lamb, Hornets. Game Gear Relic for the Nets, Paul Pierce. So I can be game. Game used. Game worn. Brooklyn Nets. Going out to Bain. Yep. Yeah, no problem. There's uh for us, I mean there's there's one really close to you. Uh, well, I think you're in like Sacramento. I think there's uh there's one in Rockland. Probably the closest distributor to you. There's uh also one in Reno. One in San Jose. 69 of 99 LeBron James. Going out to the Lakers. It's got to be a Cavs jersey, right? Enclosed game-worn material, which was worn as a member of the Cleveland Cavaliers. Going out to the Lakers. Yeah, it's, it's a little wacky. 6 of 99, Alfarik Aminu. Relic going out to the Blazers. Yep. Yep, that is correct. Eighty nine of ninety nine. Relic of Chris Dunn going out to the Chicago Bulls. And do. Thirty-three of forty-nine. Auto relic Nikola Miritic. 
Going out to the Pelicans. Auto Relic. Benjamin. 56 of 99. Jalen Rose. Going out to the Raptors. 56 of 99. On card auto. Raptors and Golfo. Eleven of forty-nine. Peja Stoyakovic, Sacramento Kings. It's a Chris Webber, Mike Bibby era. Going out to Taka. All right, got a nice one coming up. Horizontal. 50, or 37 of 49, RPA, Marvin Bagley. Little boom. Very nice. 37 of 49, Sacramento Kings going out to Taka. Congrats. First Bagley we pulled. Thirty-seven of forty-nine. It was a king's box. All right. If you went hitless, we'll send out a five-dollar hitless credit for you. That was PYT number three. I'm gonna go over the remaining schedule before we sign off and take a quick lunch. All right. So we come back at. Come back at 115 with PYT number four. I think there's still some teams discounted, still available. Uh, 145 PYT five and 215 PYT six. So we come back from lunch, we have three PYTs in a row. Then we're gonna start doing a, do a random groups at three o'clock, which is sold out. 3.30, we do have a random groups number two with, team, with uh, spots available. And then we got some random numbers and then it is pretty much all NT basketball, all day, all night. All weekend. All right. Take care, everybody. We'll be back at 1.15. See you later.